Hello everyone, my name is Xue Ping Ong and I'm a core developer of the Materials Project. Today I'm going to talk to you about the Lithium Battery Explorer. This is part 2 of a two-part series. I will demonstrate the capabilities of the Lithium Battery Explorer and show you how to perform searches. First, go to the Materials Project homepage which is given by the URL that you see here. Make sure that you are logged on into the Materials Project. You should see your email on the top right hand corner of the page. Let us now enter the Lithium Battery Explorer. This is the main page for the Lithium Battery Explorer. What you may immediately notice is that there are two big numbers in blue. What these numbers indicate is that there are 401 lithium intercalation compounds and more than 14,000 conversion battery compounds in our database as of the making of this video. This database is continuously being updated and you will find more materials when you return in the future. In the middle of the page is a search form that allows you to search for lithium ion battery materials. You can search for intercalation compounds, conversion compounds, or both intercalation and conversion compounds. The search form also allows you to search based on desired battery properties, such as the voltage, the minimum gravimetric capacity, and the minimum volumetric capacity. You can also click this checkbox to show more options, such as the maximum voltage step, the maximum volume change, and the maximum energy above hall. Let us now perform a search for lithium cobalt oxide, the most commonly used cathode material today. Type LiCoO2 into the formula search field and click search. This brings up a results table which shows all compounds having LiCoO2 as a formula in our database. There is only one such compound in our database today. The table also summarizes the key battery properties of this material, such as its average voltage, its gravimetric capacity, the volumetric capacity, the specific energy, and the energy density. To see more details about this compound, click on the link that is on the left hand side of the table. This is the details page for the lithium cobalt oxide intercalation battery material. This page shows all the key properties that will be of interest to battery researchers. For example, on the top left, you can see the voltage profile for lithium cobalt oxide. You can mouse over any of the points on the voltage profile to see more details. To the right of the voltage profile is an oxygen evolution plot. The oxygen evolution of a material is a measure of its safety. Similarly, you can mouse over any of the points on the plot to see more details, such as the reaction that the material will undergo at various oxygen chemical potentials. Towards the middle of the page, you can see the crystal structure for lithium cobalt oxide. And to the right of the crystal structure, there is a table which summarizes the key properties of interest for lithium cobalt oxide. For example, you can find the average voltage, the minimal voltage, and the maximum voltage, as well as the gravimetric capacity, volumetric capacity, specific energy, energy density, and also the percentage volume change for the material. Further down the page, you can find details about voltage pair properties. These are pairs of properties between pairs of materials during the operation of the 
lithium ion battery. Finally, at the bottom of the page, you can see a, a section on the diffusion calculated diffusion properties for the lithium cobalt oxide material. These properties are calculated with empirical bond valence potentials. They show the diffusion paths in the material as well as estimated activation barriers for the material. Let us now return to the Lithium Battery Explorer homepage. I will now do another demonstration searching for a conversion battery material. Let us now search for Fe, F3, a commonly a, co a common material being investigated as a conversion battery. Again, let me click search and this will bring up all conversion battery materials having FEF3 as a phase in the conversion path. Let us now bring up the details page for FEF3. This is the details page for the FEF3 conversion battery material. Similar to that for intercalation materials, you will also see a voltage profile on the page. In addition, you also see a, in the voltage pair properties the various reactions that are undergone during the conversion voltage path. Finally, at the bottom of the page, you see all the compounds that are transversed during the as part of the conversion reaction for this material. This concludes the tutorial on the Lithium Battery Explorer.